Hi all, Tech Terror down here. So today I wanted to do a quick demo of a really neat feature in Google Sheets and it's called Autofill Formula and it sort of blew my mind a little bit. So I read this tweet that was talking about an auto completion success where they started typing out the cancer type and Google Sheets did a pretty cool example of figuring out exactly what that person was doing. So they had this semi-structured format here. They were typing in the type of cancer. So looking at this one, prostate, then breast, then uterine, then bladder, then cervical. And this was pretty cool because Google Sheets said, yeah, we know what you're trying to do there. You're trying to find the type of cancer in front and wrote this really fancy formula to help them so they didn't have to do it one by one. So of course, I wanted to try this out myself and found out that it is actually pretty easy to do. So if you were trying to replicate exactly what that person was doing, you could actually type in a type of cancer here. I just pulled in a list. Now let's imagine I was just trying to pull the first word from here for each of these. And so you can see it's going to show that formula. It pulls that nice left formula, looking for the space after and just pulling everything before. So if you're pretty advanced at Excel, you'll probably know some of these functions like left and being able to use find to do what you want. But if you're not so familiar with Google Sheets, then this might be a little bit more tricky. And so for example, we might be doing something like putting the first name and last name together in a new cell. Now, if you're really familiar with Google Sheets, you'll know that there's a simple formula called concatenate. You can also use the and sign to make this happen really simply. But if you were doing this manually, like a lot of people do, since they don't know the formulas, this nice smart fill or autofill formula suggestion is super helpful. And so here it's offered a suggestion of concatenate. And another example here is, you know, pulling out an unstructured or semi-structured email address. So this used to happen a lot at an old job of mine, and I would need to pull these out. And this was before smart fill was an option. And so I had to spend a lot of time trying to figure out what formula would work best here. And so pretty neat that once we've given it a couple of examples, so typically it takes about three times of you repeating something, it's going to give you a really nice formula to do that. And so a fairly complicated formula, but we don't need to know that much about Google Sheets. We just need to know that we can type something in and have it fill out that formula for us. Really cool feature. I'd love to hear if you tried it out on something and it worked flawlessly. These are some text-based examples, but I'm sure it works on a lot of other things too. And I'd love to continue testing to see what else it does. Let me know if you have any questions and hit that subscribe if you want to see more tips like this one. And thanks for watching.